What is going on YouTube? Just helping you out here. And in this video, I will be building the mission models contained in bag 14 for the FLL Superpowered 2022-2023 game. Contained in this bag are the innovation project bricks, and this bag is very interesting because there are not actually any instructions. You will need to design and build your own model that in some way represents your solution to the innovation project. However, there are two criteria that this model needs to meet. It must be made from at least two white Lego pieces from these three bags, and it must measure at least four studs in at least one direction. Now there are a couple other things to consider. You can get 10 points in the robot game if your innovation project model is at least partly in the hydrogen plant target area in the middle of the field. So you want to make it something that is easy to consistently transport across the field and place, and it wants to be something that does not get in your way for future missions. Now I'm going to go ahead and build my own model to show you an example. All right, so just to show you an example, I'm going to be using these two Lego pieces, a two by four white brick, and this two by two cylindrical brick with an axle hole in the middle. And to make my model, all I'm going to do is take the cylindrical piece and insert it in the middle of this piece right here. And now before, I mentioned that this needs to meet two criteria. The first being that it needs to be made of at least two white Lego pieces from bag 14. Here we have two white Lego pieces that are from bag 14. So we fit that requirement. And the other one is that it must measure at least four studs in at least one direction. And so if we take a look at the top here, you'll see that it measures one, two, three, four studs in this direction. And so it meets that second requirement, making this a viable model. Now, before we end this video, there is one more thing that I would like to point out, and that is this orange piece that was also contained in bag 14. And for those of you who don't know, this is a tool to help you build. And essentially what you can do is you can use this to help get pieces apart if you make a mistake. So starting at the left here, you'll see that this end is tapered and this edge right here is actually reasonably sharp. And so what you can do is if you have two Lego pieces that are stuck together, you can use this end to get between them and then pry them open. Now, if we come down here, you'll see we have this axle and this is good for if you get a pin stuck or an axle stuck, what you can do is stick this axle into the axle hole or the pin hole from the opposite side and essentially push out that axle or push out that pin. And then finally, over here, we have these two studs here and on the bottom, we have these two here. And so what you can do is if you have a piece on the bottom that you're trying to get off, you can stick these two studs to it and then pry it off like this or in the opposite way, if you have a piece on top, you can stick this on top like this and then pry it off that way. So this can be a pretty nifty tool when you go to build. I am a little surprised they put it in bag 14 since they encourage you to build the bags in order. So I would have expected this to be in bag one like they've done in previous years, but I'm guessing they had a reason for putting it in bag 14. So I would recommend using this if you have any mistakes and you're having trouble getting the pieces apart. I would say it definitely beats using your teeth, which I'm sure many of you have done, including myself. All right, so overall, you should have these three bags of innovation project bricks that you can use to build your own model. Here I have an example model just to show you how it meets the criteria. And finally, we have this little tool here that will help you get pieces apart if you happen to make a mistake with your builds. All right, and so that's about it for this build video. Feel free to check out all our other LEGO videos in the playlist in the top left corner. If you enjoyed this video, please drop a like, leave a comment if you have any questions or an idea for a future video. Feel free to follow my Instagram in the description below. And lastly, please don't forget to subscribe and tell your friends about my channel so I can grow and help more of you guys out. I'm just helping you out. See you in the next video.